Hey, what's up, everybody? Just want to give you the recap. Sorry if it's a little late. Um, so the Yankees played the Toronto Blue Jays today, and they won 8-3. to They are really looking good. Garrett Cole pitched. And I got to tell you, I felt like I was in Atlantic City at the uh, blackjack table because Garrett Cole was dealing. Dealing. Okay? Aside from the one pitch, you know, that one hanging fastball that Marcus Simeon took for a solo home run, he threw five innings pitched, four hits, one run, one on run. Uh, one walk and eight strikeouts, and he was hitting 100 on the regular today. And it was 78 pitches, I think 48 or 49 of them were strikes. And so he was dealing. He was just straight up gangster today. So good job, Garrett Cole. He's ready for the season. So he'll he'll throw an abbreviated inning once more before the season starts. We're about 11 days out. So, um, and then you know we had Asher Wojciechowski come in. Unfortunately, he felt some uh, discomfort in his lat, so they took him out. Um, so he's going to get looked at. Um, Lucas Luger came in, pitched well, but he had his first hiccup and he gave up his first run today. But all in all, the, the, he's only given up one ring, the whole uh, one run the whole entire spring. So um, he'll be, you know, I think he'll be. He solidified him spot his himself for a spot at uh, in, in that bullpen, probably you know, in place of uh, Zach Britton until he comes back at least. Um, and then Luke Voigt on the offensive side, Luke Voigt in an RBI double. Our, uh, Clint Frazier smoked an RBI double over. Um, George Springer's head. And Derek Dietrich also hit an RBI single to make it 4 0 Yankees. And uh, he's looking good too. Again, he's still let by himself for potentially a spot on that, on that roster. But Tyler Wade did hit, uh, hit a double today too, an RBI uh, nice single. RBI single in the sixth, and, uh, which made it 5 1. But he actually hit that uh, before, before that TR Estrado hit a three run home run to make it 7 1. And, um, and then Wade brought it up to 8 1. And then Wojciechowski again came in, had a little bit of an issue. Lou Jay came in. Uh, but all in all, the Yankees uh, solidified uh, an 8-3 to win today over the uh, Blue Jays. So another solid win. I think they're 13-5 and now this spring. So everybody's for the most part healthy. The starters are looking good, and which is one of the most important things for me. And not to be overlooked, but one of the things I've noticed this, this spring is Aaron Hicks. Not only... Solidify himself, you know, as a, as a solid number three hitter. But he's drawing a lot of walks, so he's solidifying himself as an on base machine too. Whether it be drawing a walk and letting the guys behind him drive him in, or driving other people in ahead of him, so he, he's doing a lot of things to to make himself a good number three hitter. So that's I I do not want to not mention that, and I think it's important, and I think it's important that a lot of the other Yankees are also drawing walks too, and. Uh, on base is on base. So we have a lot of guys who can drive other people in. And this is something that the Yankees had not done a lot recently over the last couple of years. They've been just swinging at bad pitches, and there's been a lot of strikeouts. And I wouldn't be surprised if their strikeouts are down significantly and their walks are up significantly this year, too. So, again, on base is on base. So you know, a lot of run scoring opportunities for a lot of these dudes. So kudos to Aaron Hicks, too, aside from being an elite center fielder as well. So that's the update right now. Um, you know, I'm going to give my next recap of their next game as well tomorrow. Uh, yesterday was their last off day until the day before the season starts. So they're going to be playing consecutively for the week. So if you want to see that recap and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do so right now before you leave and hit that notification so you don't miss it. Um, you'll know exactly when it's coming out. So I appreciate all your support. And again, please hit that subscribe button. Even if you don't plan on watching all the videos or not, I want to get up to 2,500 subs. So I appreciate all your support. Have a good night. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you next time.